Hey guys, it's Carter from Wheel of Fire Alarms here, and it's time for the very first MS5012 system test. Let's get started. All right, so as you can see, um, we have the panel now and it's all set up here. Uh, the system is brand new, so I'm excited to do a first test with it today. Um, the system con consists currently of two devices and a pole station. Um, however, I do plan to expand, but I don't know when that's gonna happen. This is what we have so far, um, but I think it's pretty cool what we have. Um, here's the panel, uh, let's go ahead and open it up. And we have uh, the battery with the battery cables, so there's obviously no troubles. Um, only thing I've done is put a piece of tape over the little mini horn here because it's annoying and it drives my mom nuts. So I decided to put that over there so it's not as annoying and doesn't drive her as insane. Um, so anyway, that's the story with the panel and it's all hooked up, connected to AC power. And uh, yeah, so over here we have the pole station. I uh, decided to put up the Ademco T-Bar uh, because it came with this panel and I haven't used this thing really. It's just kind of been sitting on my shelf. Um, I do plan to get these wires uh, behind this board at some point. Haven't done that yet. That's on my um, uh, check off list there to do. But Ademco T-Bar is here. And this is the pole station spot right by the exit. Now we're going to go over here, um, right up here, we have a Wheelock MT, uh, right on this blank wall here. So I originally wasn't going to have it flush mounted, but um, we ran into a problem running some wires through the wall um, to the back box. There, apparently the genius that built this little bathroom decided to put like a 14 inch header up here that allowed us not to run wires through. So it was actually easier to flush mount it like this, and my dad wanted me to do that, so there we go. Uh, and I think it looks very professional. Um, so next, for the final device, we go in the little bathroom here, and we can see that we have a Wheelock RS in here. Yes, this is a Wheelock RS. I've had a lot of people saying that it's a Wheelock RSS. This is a Wheelock RS. It says so on the back. Uh, this is... Um, fixed candela and it's not sinkable, which is why it's an RS. And I think it looks pretty good here. I put it up because it matches with the MT. I'm hoping to maybe get some more matching alarms for this system, we'll see. All right, so uh, we're gonna go ahead and give this system a test here. First time, oh boy, I have no idea what the MT said on it. I think it may be on tone. But um, very exciting, here we go. Three, two, one. Let's go in the bathroom, and it's flashing away. And we're going to go ahead and silence here. There we go. I've forgotten how annoying the Code 3 Tone option is. Um, and we can go ahead and reset the pull station. Let's see, we're gonna, um, maybe we'll have a little contest. How many days can I go without forgetting to reset the pole station? Um, let's see, get the key out here. Um, there it is. It's a nice shiny one. Interesting thing about this T-bar is that I have to turn it to the right instead of the left. Usually you turn those to the left on pole stations, but this one decided to be different. Oh boy. Okay, so we can go ahead and reset. All right, and that's cleared. And I guess we can go ahead and um, do a key activation. So we'll go ahead and do that. That's obnoxious. All right, and then put that back. And we'll go ahead and do a reset. 
And maybe we should demonstrate some features on this panel here. So let's go into programming mode. Uh, we can go mode, enter the default passcode that I can't show. Probably can't since this panel is pretty rare, but not going to. I don't want to get in trouble. Uh, we can double click first event, enter code 58. That will get me verification. And turn that to 1 for on, enter. And go to mode. This one I can show at 6676 will get me to normal mode. There we go. So now when I pull this, it's going to have a nine second delay, which means I can walk back um, there and um, show the MT go off. So should be pretty fun. Here we go. Show you the bathroom one more time. There we go. And let's go ahead and reset this. Fun fact, the first time I powered up this panel and did a whole test, I forgot to reset the pole station. And we'll go ahead and reset. All right, and there we go. Well, I think that does it for uh, the very first system test on my MS5012. Hope you guys enjoyed, um, and with that being said, like the video, leave comments, and of course subscribe to the channel.